G'day superstars, I use DaVinci Resolve all the time, pretty much every day for my work, as well as doing these videos and other videos that I do as well. And I'm always discovering these extra little tips and tricks that uh, DaVinci has. It's such a deep well of functions that you can just never learn everything. It's called object removal. Let me show you how it works. So I've got this clip here of a woman on a beach. This just makes the clip nice and short. We're gonna trim it down a little bit. And we'll drag it down into our timeline. So select your clip, go over to the color page, and we're going to create a mask around this object and we're gonna remove this woman from the frame. So click on this mask area here, click that, and come down to the pen tool, and then just draw a mask around her, like so. Now we're gonna go into our tracking window, which is just here, we're gonna click that. Make sure that your, when you did your mask, that your pointer was at the start. It doesn't really matter, it'll track both forward and back anyway. And just go to these two arrows down here and track it forward and back. If you scroll from start to finish, you can see that at the end point, it's still tracked. Now you've done that, you go up to the top up here, right click and go add node, add serial node, go to effects, type in OBJ to get object removal, drag that onto that second node, and then connect the mask to that footage using the blue dots just here like this. Because we've got motion, we're going to, have to use scene analysis, which is just up here. So click on scene analysis to analyze the movement of that scene. As you can see, it's created a gray blob around her. And then once you've done that, scroll down to build clean plate. And now if we scroll through our footage, It's not super perfect, but it's not bad. If you're a beginner and you're new to DaVinci Resolve, then you're gonna love this next video here, which is 36 shortcuts that you really have to know to make your life a lot easier. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.